in exploring the culture of HBCUs. It's impossible not to include the phenomenon that is the HBCU marching band. Every performance, an unapologetic seance. It's that pride that you don't get anywhere else. A moving musical mystical magic. It's such a powerful sensational experience that HBCUs gather like gladiators facing each other on the field of battle to see which band has the most powerful mojo. You think you know pride until you are in a marching band, a HBCU marching band. There is nothing like it. There's so much history. I've been the dreamer, but oh how wonderfully you have interpreted my dream. You have interpreted. Bethune Cookman University is grounded in rich tradition, founded in 1904 by Dr. Mary McLeod Bethune with a dollar fifty cents, five little girls, and faith in God. The only woman founder of an HBCU, Dr. Bethune, dedicated her life to improving the lives of African Americans. With the power of education, political activism, and civic service, Dr. Mary McLeod Bethune became one of America's most inspirational daughters and will soon make history as the first black person to have a state commission statute in the U.S. Capitol's Statuary Hall. Carrying on the tradition of excellence of the Marching Wildcats of Bethune-Cookman University dates back to the late 1900s. This historic band started out under the leadership of Dr. Mary McLeod Bethune. That's right, believe it or not, she was our very first band director. The story of the music, the precision, and the tradition of the only band in the world that's guaranteed to show up and show out is deeply rooted in the DNA of our band directors. Directors with names like Pike, Valentine, Barry, Bray, Powell, Potia, and Wells. They made coming to an HBCU football game not about football, but about halftime. Because halftime is showtime. I would say the HBCU band life here is, I think at this point it's a part of the school's DNA. I think you can't go anywhere around the school without anybody knowing about the band program. And uh, it's, it's really crazy to look at a full list of our accomplishments and, and see how much we've actually done. The Marching Wildcats have been fortunate to have a lot of national and international recognition over the years. And a lot of those things came about. It started, I believe, in 1998. We did our first national performance with MTV and with Shaggy for Rock and Jock. Performing along with the Tampa Bay Buccaneer cheerleaders and the Bethune Cookman Marching Band, baby. Give it up. Fox Studios call for Drumline. And it Since I was little, I actually seen Bethune Cookman on Drumline, and I was like, oh my gosh, Mom, what school is that? She was like, oh, that's Bethune Cookman, you didn't know about him? Uh, ever since then, I used to watch all the videos. So once I came to the band camps, it was pretty clear where I was coming. Being from D.C., marching band isn't what it is in the South. I saw them for the first time, and it was just a wall of sound. I hadn't heard anything like it ever, and I said, in that moment, I'm coming up with Dylan Cookman. There's no question about it. I'm not going anywhere else but with Dylan Cookman. From the DNA of Dr. Mary McLeod Bethune, we built the program, broke records, won awards. We are excellent and unapologetic about our excellence. And whatever you do, don't fix your mouth to talk about the Marching Wildcats of Bethune Couple University if it's not legendary icon, innovator, heavyweight champion. And just in case you forgot, when we show up, we show out. The NFL Super Bowl, Pro Bowl, Tampa Bay Buccaneers, Miami Dolphins, Jacksonville Jaguars, Ellen DeGeneres Show, EA Sports, 13 consecutive years, Honda Battle of the Bands, the movie, Drumline, the critically acclaimed Netflix docuseries, Marching Orders. Every vote counts on CBS Television with Alicia Keys, America Ferreira, and Kerry Washington. The powerful viral performance in Houston, Texas with Stella and Grammy Award-winning gospel artist, Leandria Johnson. 
named the number one HBCU marching band in the world by Black Excellence, a decade of dominance. The undefeated, undisputed heavyweight champion of all college marching bands, the Marching Wildcats of Bethune-Cookman University, the Pride. On behalf of the Marching Wildcats of Bethune-Cookman University, we would like to thank Portia for this amazing opportunity.